Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Truth Council 23 with me, Truth Nunez, and our spiritual council. We're so thankful to be here with all of you to share today's collective energetic read, keeping in mind that we are reading collective energies. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. You are and forever will be the masters of your experiences of what you will or what you will not into this creation. We're going to go ahead and get started right away by honoring and thanking our spiritual council. I want to honor and thank my abuelita, my grandmama, my abuelita Gladys. Nunez Maldonado. I also want to honor and thank my abuelito, my grandpapa, abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez. I invite you to do the same. I do honor and thank your trusted ancestors, those that protect and love and guide you. I invite you to honor whatever religious force, whatever spiritual force, whatever makes you feel good, grounded, and connected to the all. In this experience, you can also take a moment of silence to be in silence with yourselves, and that's also more than enough. Let's get started, my loves. I am getting the number eight for some, uh, the number 42. I'm getting uh, through that the number six, the choice, the lovers, a Gemini could be significant for some or something could have started in late May, early June. Um, I am getting eight energy. So August could be significant for some. The sign of Leo or the sign of Virgo could be significant for some, or this month has been very active for some. And then with that number, uh, I am getting the number seven. I'm also seeing the eight of wands. I'm getting chariot energy movement, but I'm seeing the seven of cups as well. Uh, maybe a lot of communication from different sources, uh, a lot of options, needing to move quickly uh, to select certain things. Uh, for some of you, it has to do with <clears throat> speaking your truth in a situation for others it has to do with distance travels for others it has to do with telepathic communication and the different channels that you channel and uh, i got to see the movie um the blue beetle my lovies is that the name i think it is the blue beetle uh spirit put it in our hearts to want to see it and spirit made us uh made it happen for us and we got to see it and it was really really interesting um so for some of you uh there's a theme i was also reading a research paper uh and we were talking about how you know even with common goals you know how different people uh, take different routes to get to the same goal to get to the same source um maybe for some there are a lot of paths and you must choose one because there are a lot of paths the seven of cups is technically the different paths and portals maybe emotional states uh but uh gemini energy the lovers it's like a choice that you're making it's a big choice once you make that choice you're going down a path for a while and uh technically you're sacrificing um or giving up not necessarily a full sacrifice um but i am getting cancer energy uh, the hanged person um um, not necessarily having two things and, and sacrificing one, uh, but more uh, by nature of, for example, by nature of me being here, I'm not riding that bus, I'm not going with that truck, I'm right here. So I am choosing to be here out of all of the seven of cups, out of all of the options and emotions that can be sparked but here or there or there. There are a lot of paths, but um, I'm choosing to be here. <clears throat> there's something there for some uh it involves you clear clearing your throat or your throat chakra and speaking your truth in a situation spirit was also giving us ace of swords energy for some so there are uh clarities and truths that you're seeing or revelations that ace of swords doesn't always bring in a communication uh ace of swords sometimes is just you witness something or spirit gives you the the, the clues to be able to see the truth for what it is whether or not you have tangible proof of something it's just an inner knowing it's the truth it's it hits you uh because they're it's almost like an undeniable truth for something i'm getting capricorn energy with that uh something could have started in capricorn season um late december into early january but i was also getting late january for some um or you could be dealing with a capricorn uh or you could be dealing with a uh, drug dealing for some of you, you could be drug dealing um you could be dealing with a drug dealer um but for for some of you, you could be dealing with very toxic situations, uh, Capricorn energy, the devil energy, or something that charmed you, um, or the raw energy and the chaotic energy of life that if unchecked leads you to um, some type of destruction or harm to yourself or to others. Bon bye, good. Oh, perfect timing. They're about to leave.
There's a reason why that drug dealer thing came in. For some, uh, drug use could be in your field or, uh, again, drug dealing or working with somebody. For some type of uh, an illicit substance. <laughs> I'm seeing the Ace of Spades. Um, there's a signature that's worrying someone because it's coming in with the Eight of Spades and the Eight of Clubs and the Eight of Diamonds. A lot of movement in your area, a signature for some, a contract that needs to be signed or paperwork that needs to be signed or a little bit of money for some. You could be signing a check. You can be getting a, a small paycheck, nothing too crazy. Something that is owed to you it could be expenses for some. You could be reimbursed for something. I'm getting expense reports. Here we go with this expense reports energy. It's time, my lovies, for some to fill your expense reports. Or someone around you. Take out resonates. Or payroll. Payroll is due for some. Someone's getting a new car. There's a new car in the field for some. A new car. A brand new car, Spirit is saying. For some, a brand new car is in your field. You could have recently gotten a brand new car or you're getting a brand new car. A brand new car. So you can go far. That's what's coming in. 751 on the clock. 751, 7 and 6 energy, which is very present for some 7 and 6. Uh, 7 energy and then 6, the choice, the lovers, and 7, the chariot movement as we're talking about a car. You put that together, that's 13, and there's a 4 in there. So there are delays. For some of you, there's a delayed purchase of a new vehicle or a delayed travels or delayed triumph in a situation, a big situation though. A generation lacking in patience. I'm getting those lyrics from Drake. A generation lacking in patience. A generation lacking in patience. And I'm not talking about Gen Y, Gen Z, Gen... I'm talking about everybody. A whole generation. Everyone that exists at this particular time.
<clears throat> what is up? What is up? What is up? Hot stuffs. How's it flowing? How's it pulling? How's it pulling? Here we go with this Poe energy. Jesus. Um, the life of Poe is so present for some. What is up? What is up? What is up? Hot stuff. How's it flowing? How's it going? How what's popping? What's cracking? The number 88 could be significant for some. I looked at the time at 1108. The number 88, if you multiply, could be significant for some. Um, or the number 11 or the number 8. But uh, what's up, darlings? We are reading for um, whenever spirit needs us to read for. Technically, in spirituality, there are endless ways, infinite ways to tell time. Uh, so we are really reading more the energies. But for our sake and purposes, uh, our Gregorian calendar is important to us. And so technically, uh, we are reading for Gregorian August, um, not 19th, but for some for the 19th. We are actually reading for August 18th, 2023. That is nine energy. And nine energy brings in endings. Nine energy is a completion of a cycle. Nine energy, um, especially on a Venus day, it could bring in an emotional ending for some. I felt like crying, um, especially when I was thinking spirit, when I was thinking the all, when I was saying, when I was saying, yes, my lovies, when someone was saying something for some, someone's going to say something and it's going to make you want to cry because it's going to bring an ending of a situation I'm getting because it's going to make you want to die or transform. <clears throat> death energy scorpio energy a transformation for some the throat chakra is really bothering um for some there's something that you really need to express whether it be your truth whether it be speaking your truth acting your truth being your truth being more authentic in you whatever that means to you uh, expressing what you truly feel in situations because for some this could this could lead to a lot of issues with the throat for some of you in the in the in the summertime uh i was gonna say in the winter you get sick quite a bit but in the summertime too for some of you you can have a lot of issues with your uh, uh, with your mammary glands okay for some of you it's with your mammary glands uh for others or someone around you take it how it resonates or for some it has to do with maybe with um maybe it has to do with a pregnancy for some someone doesn't know how to speak their truth about a pregnancy or or lack thereof or whatever for some of you it could have to do with a creative venture um it's curious to me how the mammary glands um if uh if a woman is near a child that she has some type of an emotional bond with um even if that's not her child she'll start to lactate uh, maybe for some of you, this has to do with someone's uh, a stepchild or uh, a child in law. Take that how it resonates. It's coming in for a reason. It's very interesting. Um, but uh, nine energy brings in an ending. For some of you, there may be an ending that affects the child or that affects someone that you see as your child. Uh, maybe for some of you, you have to give up a situation and um, you may lose contact or not be as close to someone you considered uh, a child or a student or someone that looked up to you. Take it how it resonates, or this could be you in this. Uh, uh, roll take it how it resonates um but nonetheless nine energy does bring in an ending of a situation uh nine energy can also um bring in a death of someone so you could be learning the death of a family member excuse me not of a family member but for some of you it could be an estranged family member because nine energy tends to bring in um someone that is not too close to you nine energy tends to bring in for example a co-worker can tell you that uh their uncle passed away yeah, that's usually with nine energy. But for some of you, it could be a, a family member. It came in for a reason. That's how spirit gave it to us. Um, so for some, um, just so you know, it's like me being bombarded with, with thoughts and I only have one mouth. So sometimes like it's like things want to like take priority and then sh they just, sh for some, I, I, it's uh, spirit's asking us to explain. Um, but uh, no one's to blame. That's how it's coming in. No one is to blame. No one is to blame in this situation. That's how it's coming in. There's a legal matter in someone's field king of spades energy um but venus day venus day emperor 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 energy spirit is saying but it's empress energy but for some of you, you could be dealing with an aries or an emperor or a father figure and something's very emotional because venus energy is tied to the sentimental it's tied to love nurturing it's tied to the beauty something again for some it made me want to cry when i was thinking spirit uh when i was thinking the y'all especially for unconditional love and for mercy for the mercy that spirit has to uh allow us to go through uh difficult lessons or all types of lessons not just difficult ones just to go through this process and and to see the beauty of it all even when things get um uh questionable <laughs> Sintas could be significant for some Sintas or some you could be ordering paper i'm seeing like uh reams of paper or printer paper 
even technology, which is very five of sword energy, but even technology, how, how it's uh, evolved, what we call technology. As the humans have lost their, for example, there, were, there was a time where humans would just calculate things in their mind. Isn't that interesting? And now it's like you turn to calculators. I don't remember the last time I calculated something though. <laughs> Um, actually, no, I calculated uh, mileage a few days ago. All right, oniva, oniva, oniva. Ace of hearts energy in your field, the home, the couple. I'm getting a lot of eight energy. I'm also seeing the eight of hearts energy, some type of an invitation for some of you. you could be visiting someone in their home, or you can be having guests over in where uh, in the place where you live, where you stay. Uh, here we have a situation with a gentleman who is blocked. For some of you, uh, Jack of Clubs energy is, um, it's a, uh, in the private reading, for some of you, there's, uh, you may, be, you may not know, why is it coming in this way? For some of you, there's someone that you're communicating with, um, the energy feels frustrating. There's a block in a situation with someone who's either slightly older or slightly younger than you or the same age as you. Uh, but this person could be a little superficial. They could be a little immature. They care a lot about what they look like. They like to take care of themselves. This could be a professional in some setting. This could be for some a love interest or this could be um, someone you're getting to know um, or someone that needs to support something. Uh, but for some, there's a block in this situation. There's someone who's not communicating Communicating. This could be someone you're communicating with via email because I'm seeing emails. For some of you, this could be a professional person who um, doesn't take their job too seriously and it's frustrating you. It feels really annoying because <laughs> he's blocking a signature. And for some of you, there's the death. You could be learning the death of a young person, uh, someone who's slightly younger, slightly older. It's coming in as masculine energy. Or for some, someone is ending a contract based on a stalemate. For some, someone could ghost you. That's how it's coming in. For some, if you're getting to know somebody, um, there's not a... Uh, this person is holding back. They're not giving their, their plan of attack. They have a plan of attack. If you're coming into a relationship or some type of connection like that, uh, that's already going to tell you how far it's going to go. Um, but for some of you, there is a death. Ace of spades with the nine of spades. There could be a coworker who tells you that, you know, um, we can't complete this project or we can't complete this contract because um this person feels tired this the this person can drink a lot someone drinks a lot a lot a lot they feel put on the spot for some of you um uh you may okay this could be, because I wanted to see what's behind these aces. So for some of you, this could be your significant other or you as a man who's dealing with someone like this. For some of you, you're ending something. For some of you, if you're picking between, um, you know, significant others, you're, if you're not in a relationship, um, there's you're going to end something with someone who's not serious to go with someone who's actually committed. Um, but there's some type of betrayal here for some uh, ace of spades with the ace of clubs, two aces right together. <clears throat> some type of a betrayal that happened uh for some of you there could have been a significant other that was betrayed by someone or they're gonna see something as a betrayal or someone's gonna there's gonna be an ending of a friendship for some because there's a jerk who betrayed somebody um spirit was giving that to us a, an energy of a gentleman who's not a friend a, f a fake friend a fake flexor too um i'm seeing someone with a bmw it all rhymed <laughs> in time that's how spirit's saying in time someone's getting to see that someone's a friend of me uh, I can't even I don't know what a, uh, that's how it's coming in but this person's just a fake there's a they're a phony and a fake they could have started something about skating something about skate something about skating something about Kate here we go with uh, the name John could be significant for some boom boom by coots my lovies give them the boots my lovies <sighs> That energy has been in the field for some. Picking friends wisely, it's important. It is important to pick your friends wisely. A uh, wise spirit once told me, in this realm, there are no such thing as friends. I like to call people brothers and sisters. And we all have a mission together and a purpose. And if we flow together, we flow together. If we grow together, we grow together. 
but we don't force it especially if it's based on lies for me mm -mm. something about a surprise someone's gonna be fr uh friendly someone's gonna be friendly it's gonna try someone's gonna try to befriend someone or rekindle something it's gonna surprise someone because someone's really fake for some you could be dating someone and you're gonna find out that someone was bashing you to the person that you're gonna be dating um and something about skating something about skating some are going skating it keeps coming in skating um i'm seeing skating but someone was already skating on thin ice with with this being um or your significant other and you're gonna it's like like it's like mis like misjudging someone's wife or someone's husband that's how it's coming in someone could have done some shady ish to try to like be we someone's really weasel they, someone has an energy of a weasel i'm seeing an asian man but take it how it resonates um someone has an energy of a weasel and they're a clown they don't take themselves seriously um, I don't know my lovies. I don't know, but you got a face to face here ace of diamonds You have news coming in ace of diamonds is something that you're getting like a news a letter an email Some type of communication that announces that there needs to be a face to face I am getting la naissance for some of you This could be a birth of a situation after a face to face For some of you this could have to do with a significant amount of money because i'm seeing the nine of clubs Or with a work project or a work situation or a business deal. Take it how it resonates. Bomba ikut, my lovies. Give them the boot, my lovies. <laughs> I like saying that too. 2221 was on the clock. 2221 was on the clock. All right, we have a face-to-face -face and we have that eight of spades and that cuts the story. And for some of you, you'll be, uh, if we do want to continue, for some of you, you'll be hearing that a sister, a friend, or a daughter is not doing too well. Uh, something about she's uh, she's on antidepressants for some. For some, you have a sister, a daughter, or a friend who's on antidepressants. Just checking in for some because Spirit it was giving us drug addictions and it's all coming in for a reason. Um, Ace of diamonds, a face-to-face -face with some worries. For some of you, could be worried about a face-to-face -face or a visual. For some of you, could be be worried about some type or, or stressing about some news uh but you will get news for some of you you will so uh that worry needs to stay in the periphery but for some uh checking in on a daughter or a friend or a sister uh who um you will be hearing from anyway but this person's not doing too well again i'm getting antidepressants uh dominant energy delays spirit gave us four energy uh so for some of you um even with uh endings there are delays nine energy where we were reading for the 18th uh but again we added all of that what do we, how did we get four earlier oh because of the numbers that spirit gave us um so there are delays in a situation delays in a construction for some uh delays when it comes to paperwork or news for some of you you are doing a lot for some of you because i'm getting the nine of wands with the ace of wands for some of you you could be doing and stressing yourself a lot about a passionate project about a work situation about a new passion about a new um opportunity uh about something you're working really hard on but for some of you it's weighing a lot on your soul um and for some of you <coughs> I, I, it's hitting the lungs it's hitting for some of you it could be a, around a place where um spirit's just inviting you to take a rest because i'm seeing like being in like a it's almost like being in a construction site 24-7. Uh, for some of you, someone needs to just take uh, some pause. Uh, 24-30 on the clock. 2-4-30 on the clock. And you take everything else out, like the zeros, and you get 2 and 4, which is 6, and then 3, which is 9. Something is going to come to some type of completion or an ending, um, but there are delays in a situation for some. You feel like you're bending. For some of you, you're trying to be flexible in a situation as you go through these delays. Uh, seven of Clubs energy, a lot of communication a lot of uh emailing messaging this is written communication but eventually these could be um a f this could be a phone call jesus something very emotional it's gonna for some of you there could be a delayed conversation it's an emotional conversation 
Um, and it's going to allow you to unlock some of that blockage emotionally <laughs> that's hitting your lungs for some Jesus. Uh, seven of Clubs energy. Um, it's text messaging. It's emailing, uh, chatting. For some of you, you can be on social media, talking to a lot of people, networking. For some of you, uh, you could be on dating sites, talking to a lot of people. Uh, but there are delays in some conversation that's going to bring changes. For some of you, there's delayed in some type of uh, a distant move or distant travel maybe an hour or so from where you live for some of you um you are getting a, a new vehicle for some of you this brings in the energy for me of a vehicle you're bringing a new uh, uh, you're, uh you're bringing a new bmw or something like that for some of you you're getting a luxury vehicle for some of you could be a veteran because i'm seeing the american flag or in government in some way. You work for the United States Corps. Certainly, Spirit is saying, certainly there are changes in communication for some. Certainly, uh, there are travel plans for some. Uh, again, not too, too far from where you currently are. But for some of you, yes, because I'm getting King of Diamonds energy. Ah, for some of you, a pregnancy, Seven of Hearts energy. But for some of you, again, we already have three sevens uh, being very, very cautious um, about your body because some, someone feels really sick. <clears throat> someone feels extremely sick and very tired seven of hearts energy is uh Pis i'm getting pisces energy uh february could be significant or something could have started in february or for some of you uh there will be a birth in february or a pregnancy in february but seven of hearts energy is a new beginning it's a pregnancy for some um or a pregnancy of somebody around you um or a reconciliation for some there could be a delay in a reconciliation for some as well i am getting that and there's that king of spades energy for some of you a uh, new organization um a new medical procedure for some of you <coughs> getting a checkup for some and going to the hospital and finding out that you're pregnant or that your significant other is pregnant everything is coming in for a reason for some of you um taking care of the mamas around you and the dadas around you as well and making sure that um, they experience a healthy pregnancy it's important and if you're pregnant uh call your sister friend uh specializing in home births i'm a doula i'm a doula i help women give birth um but i specialize in home births. so I, I would do hospital births but uh, my preference is home births but um what whoever spirit sends me to support i'm i'm all ears and all open arms <laughs> uh K king of spades energy is uh k kayla the name kayla is coming in um something about michaela the name michaela um king of spades energy uh <coughs> jesus my lovies for some some need to go and check get a, a, a routine check uh for some king of spades energy something you don't want to see king of spades energy um <coughs> jeez my lovies king of spades energy it is the medical it is the legal it's also the organizational for some <coughs> jesus for some of you can work in a big company uh for some someone's lungs are not okay they're not okay um someone has some serious uh respiratory issues um that they need either to get checked or they need to uh figure out their nervous tics For some, you can be going to an organization like a retreat or some type of a networking event or some type of a of a global a global seance. I don't know what that means, but some of you are going to like a big. It's like some a, a big bear. Something about big bears coming in. For some of you, you, could be planning to go to a ski resort or some type of a of a. The name Martin is coming in. Those are they're those funky boots. I forgot what they're called. Uh, but something Martins. Um, that could be significant for some. Uh, you have projects here. Ten of Hearts energy. You have some type of satisfaction when it comes to a work uh, situation for some. But again, if you need to take time off, my lovies, I would take the time off uh, to heal. Because again, for some, that three sevens, it's bodily aches and pains uh, or issues with health in some way. Just saying, my lovies. Eight of Hearts spirit gave us that. So invitation, some inexpect, uh, unexpected, unexpected, in expected that's funny um maybe for some of you you did expect it because i was gonna say unexpected invitations but maybe for some of you you expected this invitation 
um it's cute something feels real cute eight of hearts energy an invitation for some of you this could be a date you could be going on a date uh with your significant other or your potential significant other or you're getting to know people for some of you you could be invited somewhere and it's going to feel uh amazing for some of you um you it's like uh i don't know some some funky stuff is coming in i am getting like those those um I'm getting porn store. Spirit's calling it a porn store. Uh, but you may call it an adult shop. But for some of you, you could be invited to go to a porn store. Uh, here we have anger. My lovies, you got a pregnancy in your field. Seven of diamonds energy. There is an invitation that's going to piss somebody off. Because the way it feels is something a little sketchy. It's like um, for some, um, you could have a really envious significant, not envious, that's not the right word. Um, you could have a really jealous significant other. Someone's going to try to invite invite you again for some someone's trying to cross the line that's how it feels and someone's uh for some you have a significant other or a potential significant other that doesn't like it mm -mm. someone's really like possessive um they're protective spirit saying uh i want to clarify this this feels interesting we're gonna clarify it in a second anyway but i want to give him a chance because this is a man yeah someone what did we say a ten of wands but not what did we say we had the not I, I was seeing the nine of wands someone doesn't like um that someone's either being flirty with their significant other or their potential someone's standing their ground a lot of wand energy someone's pissed they're not happy with this my lovies take it how it resonates uh something's off though it's like i'm trying to 31 39 on the clock 3139 judgment uh and a three of pentacles For some, you could be de you could be dealing with someone again. What did we say? Uh, that Jack of Clubs with the King of Clubs. You may have like a situation where you're dealing with two different people. It's coming in as males, but take it how it resonates. You know, male, male, female, 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 male, whatever floats your boat. Uh, but for me, I'm a hetero. Uh, I'm a a straight female, and so um, and plus that's how how the energies are coming in. So that's how I speak. Um, heterosexual um but some you know take whatever resonates whatever floats your boat um but um for some you're dealing with someone who's very immature um they could be very jealous that it's like dating or not i don't even know like it's like this person puts no effort like it, it would even surprise you to know how much this person thinks they like you um because they put no effort. They could have even lied about something. They could have made up something to reject you because they were trying to protect themselves from you or from someone. Take it how it resonates. 3314 on the clock. 3314, that's 11 energy. This is a divine lesson for someone, an ascension lesson for some to in maturity, uh, to renew an energy. Because we have judgment here as well. Everybody's getting seen for who they are. For some, if you're dating someone, like, again, three of pentacles, this could be in a community or you're collaborating with a few people. You're going to know who you want to work with and who you don't want to work with. That's how it's coming in. Or you're going to know who you want to date and who you don't want to date. Or for some, you've already picked or you're already in a relationship and there's somebody else who's very immature, this person wants to act like they're wounded. They want to act like they're wounded. This person is the type of person. It's funny because I was having this conversation with somebody and I found it really sweet, like what he said, because there's some people that are nuts like this. This is the type of person that, for example, if like they don't respect your position, meaning like if maybe for some of you someone doesn't respect your position maybe for some of you this isn't a work situation and someone doesn't respect your authority or they don't respect your requests or for some of you someone doesn't re respect um like they, there's a lot of tit for tat or there's a lot of gossip for some someone could have even gossiped about someone or like sent like very like if they came off as as like passive aggressive 
because they were too stubborn. They wanted a seven of wands. They wanted to like stand for something. And then the and then the something about a domain. Two of swords, something you don't see or they didn't see how blocking this uh, there's that eight of wands that spirit showed us. A lot of wand energy. This is a lot of heat. Someone's heated. They're heated. They feel abandoned. Someone, fe but they abandoned something. It's like dating some someone's a mess. They don't like that someone's shining. They don't like that someone. It makes them mad. This is the type of someone's psychotic. They're a dad. Someone's psychotic, my lovies. They're like. I want you to stay single. They're secretly wanting someone to stay single. Like they secretly want a high, they, a high priestess saw this though. But they secretly want someone to be rejected. Death energy, Scorpio energy, uh, transformation, but something in the reverse. But they, it's like trying to reserve somebody for when they're ready to end something else. I don't know. This is a failure... There's that Gemini energy, the choice, the lovers. Uh, here's the hibernation, hermit energy. Here's a king of pentacles. Someone's in a, someone's like in some type of relationship. Nine of swords energy, and they're embarrassed. They can't sleep. Taurus energy over someone having a new opportunity somewhere else. And all they do is thinking, they're only thinking about like a sex thing. Like they've been waiting to see if somebody will like... I don't know. This is annoying, my lovey. Something's really annoying and confusing. Someone's confused and their confusion annoys them. And then they are trying to like, they have no rhyme or reason to feel the way they feel. <laughs> That's how it feels. It's like someone's real confused. Spirit, a spirit stepped in. Something about spirit cells. So this person can sell something. I'm getting like sells cars or something. Someone can sell something. Now I'm getting financing. This person feel, I don't know. Spirit said divine judgment is for somebody to be independent, to be uh, shining, to make, to make a new path for themselves. Someone's reaping the, the, the fruits of their labor. This is really bothering someone who is feeling like they need to protect. Someone's trying to protect themselves, uh, but they're also wanting to have some type of conversation. 999 energy is around this person. This person's going to have to isolate and hibernate. This person could have also secretly been wishing death on someone and spirit is saying that's not what's going to happen. And by death, yes, that can happen, but it will be a transformation in this person's life. You're right, they do deserve to die, uh, but not in the way you think. This person continuously, for some, someone continuously bombards you with negative energy. This person is all types of not okay psychologically, and they send all of that energy your way. And the beautiful thing is that you have archangels all around you. <laughs> For some, someone was trying to curse your love life so that you don't get into a relationship. They wanted you to be in a never-ending shine. <laughs> so it was like, all right. But some of you, you do have some type of a new passion. That Ace of Wands spirit gave us. You have some type of new passion, new love, new situation. This person is failing strategically. They're in all types of wands. Because you see clearly and you have happy days. And spirit is saying they don't end. No, they, they don't end. They don't end. This person wants to try to apologize for some. For some, you do have a new uh, emotional situation coming in. If you're single and ready to mingle. I don't see you being singling and mingling for much longer. But it's going to piss them, but you're going to take a risk. You're going to go in for something new because uh, you've been waiting a while. There have been delays in the situation because a lot of players, cheaters, and for some of you, someone was even trying to set something up with money to have you all types of stuck. It's like people that place bets on your love life. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you, my love? No offense. No offense. No offense. But some people be doing the stupidest shit. No offense. No offense at all. Now this person needs to go and hibernate and think about what they've done in life. <laughs> it's like, what have I really been spending my time on? Shit. We get the blessing of coming here. 
<laughs> to live and we choose to live in fear some people for some of you this has someone's worried about a legal procedure they don't sleep over a legal procedure or for some this is a medical procedure someone doesn't sleep over a medical procedure this is a gentleman for some of you someone doesn't sleep because they're or they're very depressed and worried this person could be avoiding you because they have some type of serious uh, health issue that they they brought upon themselves through their sexual escapades the number two could be significant for some for some of you, a house situation. For some of you, someone's going through some type of an issue with a construction or a house situation or a living situation. Um, and uh, it has to do with money as well. There's a new financing opportunity for some. Um, for some of you, um, you could get some type of uh, <coughs> paid time off of work. I mean, we do have some type of maternity leave or paternity leave here because for some of you, you have a pregnancy here. It's a pregnancy. It's a pregnancy, my lovies. I'm so happy. I love it. I love when the pregnancies come. They're so cute. They're so cute. Oh, oh. For some of you, um, how are we doing this? <laughs> are we doing this? Wait. There's a okay. There's a queen of diamonds. That does, someone that doesn't have your best interest in mind. Um, what do we do here? I wanna. We gotta do it again because we wanna make sure we do this right, my lovies. It's important. It's important not to fight, my lovies. And then boom. And then and then and then and then. Okay, anger when it comes to a queen of diamonds. For some of you, there's an angry female around you. The energy's been present. <laughs> Uh, for some, if you get pregnant, don't tell everybody. For real, for real, my lovies. Protect the honeys. Protect the babies. Protect the boo-boos. Protect the... Because um, Spirit was giving this to us earlier. You'd be surprised. Again, as a spiritual... As a spiritualist, as a spiritual psychologist, as someone who's done the work since she was born... Um, I'm getting there's nothing where he used to lie. The conversation has run dry. For some of you, this could be an ex. That's what's going on. Things just went dry and it was all a lie. But um, this person's going to be pissed when they find out that you're pregnant or that your significant other is pregnant for some or your future significant other. Access to relocation. For some of you, you're relocating. Um, but um, <coughs> Jesus. But. Uh, as a as a true spiritualist spirit has as and that it never came as a challenge for me it always made sense if someone is happy somewhere else let them be happy somewhere else me children are always a blessing children coming into this world it's a chance to to for all of us to repent and to do it right um do we always do it right spirit knows uh but uh spirit allows us to bring children into this world for a reason and i think it's quite beautiful um to wish any ill will on a child that shows you a lot especially as a woman that shows you a lot where the being is um for some everything is coming in for a reason <coughs> for some there's a woman who doesn't have your best interest in mind uh who may pretend to be a friend but she's going to be pissed off with your new beginning for some uh, this person is not going to be happy with your uh, new beginning. In fact, she's going to try to invite you. And for some, you're going to deny somebody. Again, for some, you have um, you have uh, a choice between uh, people or, you, or you're moving on with your life or you're doing... So there's somebody that's not going to like that you're going to deny them. You're going to deny their, their demons. You're going to be like, nah, I'm good. Thank you for the temptation. You can keep that. <laughs> That's good, my love. He's good for you. Good for you. Eight of diamonds, not too far from where you live. For some of you, uh, an invitation or something not too far from where you live. Here we have a king of hearts, a well-meaning man, a father figure. For some of you, you could be having a discussion with a father figure about your new beginnings. Um, or a well-meaning man. And here we have an eight of clubs. For some of you, this is a young brunette, a light-skinned brunette. or um, I'm seeing a light-skinned brunette in my mind's eye. Someone maybe in their early 20s, mid-20s, no more than that. Um, <laughs> she's a rat. For some of you, this person can sleep around a lot. Uh, they don't take a or they want to stay at your spot though so this person wants to stay at your spot for some 
for some you could have been messing around with someone who's very loose they don't take breaks um they're very um they have a lot of growing to do that's how it feels in the soul it's not that this person is necessarily a bad person per se it's um, more that um they just have a lot of growing to do that's all Will she take the time to do it? It's up to her. Um, but um, this person, for some, could work in administration or some type of secretarial work here. For some of you, you're waiting on some type of documents or your father figure or your father or a well-meaning man could be waiting on documents um, or paperwork that they need to sign. For some of you, you do have three eights, so soulmate energy is present. present. Uh, for some of you, three eights advises you to take care of yourself, to do the things that make you feel good because you got a pregnancy coming up, honey, honey, money, sunny, money. Yes, honeys. Um, two kings for uh, for two kings. For some of you, you could be recognized in some type of situation, or you could get an honorable mention, or someone can pay you a very sincere compliment. And for me, that's always a beauty. Um, you have two tens, so you're working on some type of project. For some of you, you're working on a project with a female that doesn't have your best interest in mind. But you'll be okay after this paperwork is is all completed. For some of you, you could be working like with a with uh, 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 I'm getting like a researcher or someone that has to help you with paperwork in some way. But you'll be okay. Everything will be fine. Um, what else do we have? We have one nine. And that's about it. All right, we're going to cover this Queen of Diamonds and we're going to cover why she's so pissed. This Queen of Diamonds. What's up, honey bunny, sunny money? Keep in mind, a Queen of Diamonds is a woman who does not have your best interests in mind. And she is looking at some paperwork for some. She's looking at money. She cares about, she's vain. This woman cares about money and she insists she is not a good woman. For some of you, this could be a few women in a situation. Uh, Queen of Diamonds twice. These women do not care about anything but money. And the, she she insists for some, this person is pissed over a lot of money. She's mad. She's not happy at all because they wanted to skip the nine of hearts and go straight to the money. This person wants to pretend like she this, there's love in a situation or there's some type of friendship or some type of an emotional connection. This person just cares about money and she's pissed about money. This has to do with a brother, a friend, or a son for some. This could be someone around a brother, a friend, or, or a son in this present moment. For some of you, there's anger when it comes to a brother, a friend, and a son or and a father figure um, in this present moment. And this is for a female. For some, there could be anger between a father and your brother. Because you got for some of you got a shady brother. Oh, yep, Jack of Spades, totally shady. And there's an issue. There's issues in the family for some. For some, uh, your brother could be going through a, a legal process or or screwing you over in a legal procedure, or they could screw your father or try to. And there's a fallout of a family for some of you. You could have a. Um, uh, this is at a distance. There's that King of Diamonds energy for some. You have success, uh, and certainly Spirit is saying. But for some of you, um, <sighs> boom, some energies need some cleansing. You got joy, my lovies. You got joy over the delays. Spirit wanted that to show. You got joy over the delays. And Spirit saying, well played. Whatever you did, you did it well. And there's a woman who's pissed. For some of you, this could be a brother's wife or a brother's partner who uh, is also just as conniving as your brother. It happens. They start dramas so that you could be exiled and isolated so that they can take up all of the energy and pretend like they're innocent churchgoers. <laughs> you gotta laugh, my lovers. You gotta laugh. You have to laugh. For some of you, certainly there's a mother and a father protecting you. Certainly there are ancestors protecting you. I had a dream about that. I'm telling you, my lovey, spiritual warfare is real. <laughs> the spiritual warfare is real. And sometimes it's like, dang, I can't believe it is you. I can't believe you do this to me. You know, we, we, we grew up together. You saw me running around in diapers. How could you fucking be so cruel? <laughs> Jesus. Such a tool. Um... But uh, you have ancestors protecting you for some. Both the masculine and the feminine. Que cosa, my lovies. Que cosa. We did want to work with our dear... Um, the, the truth tarot. The truth tarot. <laughs> All right. They want to speak right away. 
We have to have a heart to heart. A heart to heart, my lovies. 4944. What are we saying here? Because someone's a. Oh, <laughs> that's what I was going. Uh, 4944 for some. You have to have a heart to heart. 4944. You have to have a heart to heart, my lovies. Uh, someone is a tease. Someone is a tease. <laughs> I don't know if they're a tease, though. Everything is in the reverse spirit is saying. So they're not as teasy. They, they're sleazy. They, they're like, well, I don't tease people. Especially when it comes to money, honey. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> prostitution could take on different forms. It's like, tease what? <laughs> At first, that was uh, spirit was giving that to us uh, in preparation. All of the chances, um, all of the chances. Yeah, someone gave a lot. Uh, here we have angel. Someone gave a liar a chance or a lot of chances. Uh, inner cities, inner city dwelling. Something about rats, though. We did say rats earlier, so someone could live in a in a dense uh, dense area or densely populated area in an inner city of some sort. New York City could be significant for someone. This is your sign if you were looking for a sign. <laughs> Someone's looking for a sign. For some of you, if you're looking for a sign to move to a city or an inner city, that's your sign. Excuse me. Or maybe it has, I mean, there's a reason why I came in that way. That's not so a Sagittarius. Or Sagittarius. <laughs> I don't know why it's coming in that way. A Sagittarius could be significant for someone. Oh my good. There's a sign. You have to have a heart to heart. For some of you, there needs to be a heart to heart. It was the theme from the start. For some of you, there uh, needs to be uh, frank, honest discussions. Uh, for some of you, oh my gosh, a lot of movement. Here we have the west side of something. For some of you, you could be on the west side of an inner city or someone lives in the west side of an inner city. I'm getting North Park. For some of you, North Park could be significant. 5144 on the clock. Here we have the west. Here we have the west. Here we have a holiday in the U.S. For some of you, you could be going to the west coast on a holiday. What's the next holiday? Labor Day? Yeah, the next holiday is the next holiday is coming up in like two weeks. For some of you, you could be spending a holiday on the West Coast, or the next uh, in the next two weeks traveling to the West Coast. Labor Day. What would be the next holiday after that in the U.S. In the U.S., not in global, not Halloween, uh, but Halloween could be significant for some. The thirty first of October. The next one would be what Thanksgiving, where everything is closed. So between uh, September and October, uh, okay, September, someone wants to, San, Santos, something about Santos. Someone wants it to be uh, sooner rather than later. Here we have 13th. I was getting, when I got that Santos, I'm like, oh, here we go with the moon magic, uh, people pretending like they're churchgoers. <laughs> Yet they're they're doing fucking seances and satanic shit to to harm others in secret, incognito, disguise, incognito. What we're we talking about here? But have no fear, my lovies, because everything is being exposed. Because everything is about money. For some of you, twenties, someone in their twenties is in your field. We did say that earlier. Uh, but uh, for some of you, again, this is all in the reverse. Technically, spirit said. Here we have someone uh, who's angelic or the name angel could be significant for some. Moving on up. For some of you in a lunar year, you will be... So if you take from the next holiday, which is Labor Day, and then take that until a lunar year. So sometime next year in September to October. For some of you, you will be moving on up silently. For some of you, you could be working really hard over the next year on projects that are going to really take off. They're going to really take off. Major success. For some of you, they're going to really, really take off. You have some projects you're working on that are really going to take off. For some of you, you can be an operations or operations manager. Or for some of you, someone needs to get some type of an operation or checked. We did see that. For some of you, you have wolf love. Oh, shoot. For some of you, you have wolf love in your field. That's loyalty. Loyalty is royalty, my lovies. It's rarer and rarer. <laughs> Some people take sincere energy, sincere people, loving people, and they play with them like they're fucking toys. And they even F boys. For some of you, someone's on the low. Uh, maybe someone's on the low. 
uh in it for the moment for some being discerning when it comes to your options in love because for some someone's in it for uh wolf love while others are in it for the moment what are we talking about here insincerity uh versus sincerity here we have innocent operations and innocent someone is innocent in a situation this one wants to be here for some reason in it for the moment i wish Oh, this person, I wish that I knew what I know now. For some of you, this could be someone from your past who um, has uh, maybe grown up a little bit, maybe matured on, in their understanding of relationships, maybe. They're still teetering because it's going wolf love to in it for the moment. Wolf love is not in it for the moment. Here we have outdoors, something outdoors or someone outdoors. They wish that they knew what they, you know, they wish that they knew what they know now when they were in it for the moment. Ah, that's how it goes. I get it. Because the lyrics need to be finished. Someone wishes... This is how it's coming in. Someone wishes that they knew what they know now when they were only in it for the moment. At one point, someone was only in it for the moment and they didn't they didn't they were overzealous in their conquer in, the, in their conquest whatever it was um maybe outdoors for some someone may want to invite you somewhere this one's fired oh they okay so some are in the reverse spirit saying this is in the reverse so they fired wolf love they fired um loyalty and now they want it back as I was coming in. Um, children in the reverse. They wanted to hide something about children or being... Um, no, Spirit's saying immaturity. Someone was very immature when they were in it for the moment. They wish that they knew what they know now when they were only in it for the moment. And they were very immature in a situation. Dry humping in the reverse. Dry humping outdoors in the reverse. Dry humping in the reverse. What would be the reverse of dry humping? Penetration? I mean, you, still, you can still get off in dry humping. Air humping? <laughs> Wet humping? <laughs> There's a lot of tea. Didn't we see teas earlier? This is technically like, because dry humping, why dry humping outdoors? Okay, we're going to leave that there. And we have uh, 30s in the reverse. Someone looks older than what they are. <clears throat> and we have 20s and 30s and 13. 20, 2013 could be significant for some. 2030. What did we say about... No, we said one year. But 2030, the year 2030, which is right around the corner, my love, is if you really think about it. It's literally seven years away. 13 and 13. One and three is four. Here is six. And then plus three is nine. There's an ending to this situation or some type of transformation. For some, you can be getting a visit or you could be, again, traveling at a distance to uh, see somebody. Someone that's uh, rather angelic, who's very loyal to you or was very loyal to you. For some, someone could have been very loyal to someone um, who, they lost, who they lost contact with or who they lost uh, sight of. Um... This person is going through some type of uh, major lessons. This person could have had an abortion or had a, a miscarriage or someone had a failed relationship. Because we do have dry humping with children. Somebody, and they were in it for the moment. And they could have done something very, someone could have had sex with somebody in a car. So Someone did something very impulsively. It's here, spirit saying to leave it here. Spirit saying leave it to clarify someone could have done something really impulsively outdoors with somebody someone that's very immature 
Again, that fake tease. Someone could have pretended like they were a tease, but they're really a sleaze. They don't tease. They, 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 they go for it. Someone went for it. So now, wish fulfillment and a king of swords. Libra energy. They were ambitious. They they wanted to... Again, this is the story. Spirit asked us to use this tarot for... Work with this tarot for a reason. The nine of cups, 59.59 on the clock. And then one. And one, zero, 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 one. Um, so this is the story of, of the prince who dressed up as a woman pretending to because this woman only wanted to have friends only wanted to have like female friends but this prince wanted to get next to this woman and so he pretended to be a female so that he could make her fall in love with him there's there's a there's something here but someone is now seeing this there's a king of swords um i forgot what this mythological creature is called but um not so, I'm getting Lake Heron. Lake Heron could be significant for some. Uh, but this is the... Um, half lion, half eagle. But there's something else in this animal too, I forgot. Anyway, um, dang, it'll come. Um, if it needs to. The King of Swords um, is someone that tells the truth. Someone that sees things very clearly. Even if they don't speak much. Because sometimes Kings of Swords, they don't speak that much. But someone is seeing something. Uh, someone is seeing that they got played. Like a sucker. <laughs> they got played. <laughs> they got played and it broke their heart. Three of Swords. <laughs> someone got played. And they blow... They, they bl they, something about a blowjob. Um... Uh, something about a blowjob. They uh, they broke their own heart, to be quite frank, because somebody um, eight of pentacles. They were working really hard on something, or this is a work situation. Strength energy, Leo energy, a retention period. Here we have eight of pentacles, a work situation. Uh, here we have a queen of cups and a king of cups. For some, there's a, a work situation and you will be signing a document um, and you will be very happy. You will get what you deserve. For some, there's somebody that's going to want to reach out to you after holding back from you because they were having a good old effing time somewhere else. And um, they're going to be very saddened. They're going to cry. They're going to be very saddened to see that now you need to reserve yourself because you have something very balanced. Again, there's a theme here for some. There's a king of cups and a queen of cups there's a very happy couple a very emotionally giving and loving couple where somebody else uh was uh not only ruthless and cold for no reason this person enjoys being in this energy for some reason um but they also wanted to play some type of trickster and um though this person may have loyal love for you for some uh someone is gonna need to watch you be in something else very happy Because why would you waste your time with a jerk? Life is too short for that, my lovies. I am not the one to be putting up with bullshit. Mm -mm, no, I'm not, my lovies. I could be very sweet to you, but if you ain't got no clue as to the value, you ain't got no clue, my lovie. That's okay. Leo energy, strength energy. Somebody wants to reserve and hold back. They feel like they're being strong by being wrong. They feel like they're being strong by holding back in their wrongness you let them hold back my lovies you let them hold back you let them hold back they're trying to heal from a situation they're trying to heal for some someone could have ended up with an std or an sti messing around with a liar who's a loose cannon something about oh cannon someone could be from five of swords energy being sneaky now they need to reserve because now they were sneaky and a liar and trying to get away with shit Someone's also a coward in death energy. They brought an ending to a transformation. October energy, some type of transformation. Knight of Cups, they're they're reserved, they're harassing. Something about they're harassing. When they feel harassed, I don't know. Something about her ass too. Something about someone's ass. Um 
Knight of Cups energy. This person is holding back from making any um, emotional offers at this time, even though there's love in this situation because Five of Swords energy. They try to get away with something. They try to get away with courting someone else or doing something else, or they still want to be some type of Prince Charming, even though they're not. But um, they're uh, Five of Swords energy. is sneaky behavior, competitive, envious people, not caring who gets hurt in a situation. So because because they didn't care who got hurt in a situation um, they brought an ending to the situation and then somebody gets to move forward and have major success somewhere else with someone else who is not playing games because why would you want to, if uh, only if you're insane would you like someone to play games with you it's weird games uh -uh, my lovey some people love that some people live in that drama go 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 with your mama for that <laughs> no -uh. no 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 And on top of that, this person is so cocky that they that's what it felt like. They were wanting this Queen of Cups to communicate with them. It's like, you effed up, honey. What are you talking about? It's like, you're lucky I'm even kind to you. Like It's like, you want me to initiate some type of a deep conversation here? This is coming in very quickly. These people are going to travel together. Or you're traveling with your significant other or your potential significant other. Take it how it resonates. It feels beautiful. And you're also really passionate about these pe this, these people. For some of you, you could be dating a few people, to be quite frank. Uh, there's, two, there's another man showing up here. Um, Leo energy is showing up here. We have a lot of water. Cancer Pisces Scorpio. You made your choice, Gemini energy. Yeah, you made your choice, my lovies. You have options for some, you do. But you it looks like you made your choice. Whatever it is, you're going to manifest uh, a very beautiful, loving union. Something coming in very quick, my lovies, because we got 8-8 eight, eight energy here. We got 8-8-8. Eight, eight, eight. What did we say earlier about strength? Leo energy, there it is. 8-8-8 eight, eight, eight energy here. This is soulmate energy, my lovies. Good for you. This is goal made energy, my goals. Yes. This is your mm, you're making what's you're making for some of you this 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 uh this relationship started very passionate or will start very passionate, but this is you are making whatever you're making your judgment call. Uh the year of the monkey could be significant for some. You're doing what makes sense for you long term. And you're following your divine... For some of you, could have had a really big change the last few years of your life. Um, or this is going to bring in a big change because you need to make a judgment call. Everybody gets seen for who they are. You get to make your choice. For some of you, here's that Pisces energy, the moon energy. This could be a Pisces who's very attracted to you. Or you're attracted to each other. But this person was hiding it. But you followed your intuition. For some of you, not being in any illusions... For some of you, you're not in any illusions about anyone or anything. You're not in any illusions about a king of wands. You're not in any illusions about this energy of attraction, of, of fickle attraction or of magnetism. Because it's very attractive energy. It could be very six, very sexy, very sick. See, very sexy but sick. <laughs> it could be very sexy. It could be very alluring. But where, where are we going with this? Where are we fucking going with it? That's how it feels, my lovies. Just being honest, I'm just being real. I'm just a channeler, my lovies. Something about... Here we go with this Arizona energy. Anything else? This is the choice. This is the effing choice. This is the choice. It feels so good, my lovies. It's like, no, there's no question about this. And someone else is going to have to just reflect for some of you you could be hibernating with this person because what i was getting is like you're going somewhere with this being you're gonna be all cocooned up <laughs> oh you gonna keep it high priestess to the hermit oh two wise intelligent beings intuitive beings love love lessons for some of you a lot of love lessons and i knew i knew the ten of cups because i felt the ten of cups this is true love this is true effing love my lovies why would you sacrifice this for a fucking clown you wouldn't i hope not my lovies i really it doesn't look like it this person's gonna feel defeated it's like, you were a jerk. What do you mean defeat? I don't understand some people, my lovies. Sometimes I get it. I get it. But it's like, it's like, uh, um, Spirit's giving us this thing I saw on 
and you're a high priestess you're very intuitive you're high priest high priestess male female take it how it resonates very intuitive people uh very guided by your divine feminine for some of you pregnancies you're gonna get pregnant right away <laughs> Or your significant other ticket, how it resonates. Um, or for some of you, there's a pregnancy. If you're already in a relationship, there's a pregnancy in your field. Um, but Spirit was giving us uh, this thing I saw. Like some people are just really tapped. And you can't you can't vibe with them if they don't jive with you, my lovies. Here we have, you are manifesting this, my lovies. A new beginning and here's a child. For some of you, you're going to have a very magical child. Um, but... Um, I was watching this this video of these people and it, it kind of you know for me it says a lot because I've seen people like this where I'm like I can see that this if I allow this these crazies to to go further they would take it far these people are tapped um i i've talked in other videos about uh the psychopath that um, that for some reason or other I, I attracted into my life i guess the, a psychopathic part of me wanted to manifest this being um and i'm like why the hell did i even meet this person but um this person for um it's calmed down i think maybe unless he, he he the tracker in the vehicle that he put in my car is not fucking working um but um this jerk um was stalking me someone i barely fucking knew uh not only that but he got his clueless friends to jump in or family members to to jump into this to to this craziness right and for me but he's a human being i'm a human being um i have never done any anything like that to a human being that i don't fucking know right um but i saw this thing and this is why for me it's like this is bordering crazy and danger um Online, I found this video of three men and a woman who kidnapped a woman, made up a story about why they kidnapped her, put her in a dog cage, and this woman managed to escape and reported to authorities. Um, these people were stalking this woman. Um, there were a few stories like this uh, recently. Uh, one, 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 fourteen on the clock. Spirit had already has already told me, don't worry about these people. Um, they're going through some shit, and they're about to go through even more shit, and they don't get that the karma is slapping them in the face, telling them to wake up and chill. Um, but, uh... There, there are certain people that, that'll take things really far. Everything is coming in for a reason, my lovies. Uh, there are certain people that are willing to take things really, really far in this life. And then the karma that they have to live through, they pretend like they don't know. It's like this gentleman had told me once that he has issues. Well, actually, I did a reading for him and it came up that he has issues with his fucking ex-wife. Like, my lovey, what the hell are you doing stalking people you don't fucking know when you have real serious issues in your life? It's like the the other day I also saw these women. Again, unfortunately, it was a lot of black people, to be quite frank. <laughs> I don't know what the hell's in their water or what the hell happened to them. But um, um, there were there were these two women who showed up to this woman's house. So they fucking stalked this woman to her house. This man had stalked me to places with his little wicked demon friends. Had stalked me to places where I'm like, how the fuck do you even show up here? Um, like, why would you show up here to, like, why? So these women, these women uh, stalked someone to their house. When they stalked this woman to her house, they, 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 they brought drama to this woman's house. These women have fucking children. Unfortunately for them, these women got shot to death because they left with the wrong one. Because for me, it's like you push someone so far to it's like you're stalking me to where I fucking live. This is dangerous. So the woman did what she had to do. She shot them to death. It's being investigated now if they're going to press charges on her or not. For me, that's almost like depending on which state you're in. I'm like, that would be like grounds for stand your st stand your ground law. Because hello. You're going to stalk someone around, someone you don't even fucking know, bring drama to them. Some people are fucking tapped, my lovies, and then they pretend they're fucking innocent. Some people are tapped. Everything is coming in for a reason and sometimes just for a season. Some people are wicked. Mobsters, gangsters, bullies, wicked people, and they think they're fucking attractive. I don't care what kind of fucking car you drive. I don't care what city you live in. I don't care what kind of friends you, you coutoie or you chill with. Like, how do you not have some type of humanity in you? And some people don't, my lovies. They really don't. It's best to stay away. It's sad. 
something sad's coming in my lovies i don't know what this is we don't necessarily want to leave it like this something sad is coming in <clears throat> there's another man who's being investigated for kidnapping a woman and putting her in a cinder block cell that he created in his garage i'm like and he traveled all the way from northern oregon all the way to the almost to the border of oregon and and uh and california and he said, I'm stalking women who spend time by themselves. There's some predators out there, my lovies. That's why you have to be cautious. People that watch you for a while. I'm telling you, my lovies. Okay, spirit. For some, there's an alarm. It's coming in for a reason. And sometimes just for a season. Ay, ay, ay. Que miércoles. Que miércoles. An ending, a prison. An ending and a prison. That energy's been very present. <laughs> the word gang boss is coming in. Gang boss. For some, you have a happy marriage in your field. For some, you have uh, new relationships. For some, you're leaving the past behind. You have new relationships. Nouvelle connaissance. You're leaving a period of stagnation for some. For some, you're not stagnant anymore. Uh, you're not stuck anymore. For some of you, you have a new house situation. You have a marriage here. You're leaving some type of a... Uh, in the past, for some, in the past, there was a situation here. You will win some type of procedure for some. This could have to do with a lot of money. For some of you, there was someone that was using you or trying to use you. Usura, usur. For some of you, this has to do with a young brunette that could have been using you in a situation. Again, I, I did get a light-skinned brunette who's a liar. This could be a sister or a friend, a mean-spirited person. For some of you, a mean-spirited woman. For some of you, the queen of spades could bring in a mother figure or an older female. Méchant femme, mujer malvada. A, a mean woman who was using you in the past for some. You're going to win uh some type of process because there is a process here a lot of fighting with this woman for some a lot of fighting over money this could have been in a work situation for some or some type of uh issue in a work situation uh you were noble you were considerate when it came to something so you will win for some of you you have a happy marriage for some of you in a house situation for some of you um there's a lot of money in a situation that involves a sister, a friend, or a daughter. For some of you, there could be a few women involved in a situation who are your enemy. And you have uh, prosperidad. You will be prosperous in a situation. For some of you, uh, you will win some type of procedure. For some of you, there's a reason why everything is coming in. With a house situation and kidnapping and all this other. And bringing people to weird houses. Um, for some of you, if there's some type of an issue with females showing up at your house or crazy people showing up where you live you have some type of uh in the spiritual realm you won the process you don't have to give it uh you don't have to give it any more energy 11804 on the clock for some of you um you do have a happy marriage you have a happy marriage coming in and some type of, of a beautiful union for some of you there's a higher level commitment for some of you you could be having some type of higher level commitment with a sister or a friend or you could be moving in with a sister or a friend for some of you here's a daughter present as well for some of you, you will you will win some type of process against the mean woman. For some of you, your health is important. For some of you, you feel sick. It really does. It's like having to fight off that energy for some. It's really important. 
It's like focusing your energy on the things you want and not on the things you don't want. For example, again, just to use loosely that example of, of that gentleman and his friends, it made me sad. It really did because I'm like, these people are nuts. There's something else they can spend their time on. This is not the best thing to spend their time on. Why are these people like this? For some of you, there's something there for some. Channeling that energy in a different way because someone has heavy energy they're carrying and it's like, it's like an overcast. For some of you, you have new relationships. Uh, for some of you, you have new relationships. There's a vicious man in your field, or this could be you, take it how it resonates. Uh, someone with addictions, for some of you, as we're talking about shaking those energies off. Uh, vicious man with some type of addiction, a numb vicieux. For some of you, uh, there is a justice, a judicial procedure. And for some of you, your parents are protecting you from a vicious man. This is someone you barely know for some. Um, spirit is asking you to be uh, econom, uh, in economia, to be reserved when it comes to this being. Um, because this man is on some type of an addiction or drugs or some type of a substance abuse and there will be justice for some of you if there's someone harassing you there's everything is coming in for a reason you have uh parents you have for some of you these could be your parents uh for some of you someone may think you're alone in this world uh we're never alone my lovies um for example me i choose to be isolated but there's a i've met so many people in my lifetime and i have so many connections in so many different places so for some someone uh you may have a little little bit of an issue with a, a man that has addictions or has some type of psychological issues um but justice is here in the middle of this all and this is very protected by your parents or very protected by your ancestors you don't have to worry about this spirit is saying to not be uh this could be a dark skinned man for some because he wanted to flip for some of you your parents or your significant other's parents can also protect you in something again it happens first in the spiritual and then in the physical and sometimes, for some of you, you have a significant other, a, a significant other, a, a significant other who is very sincere. Bone by boots, my loveys. But who's very worried and is delaying a situation for some reason. For some of you, there are delays and contrarieties in some energies. Last but not least, the sacred trickster is in your field for some. For some, somebody can be tricking you with lies, being cautious. 801. 901, technically. For some of you, you're protected by your father or the divine. Okay, for some of you, you have a thief in your field. Uh, but these are all positive attributes, Spirit saying. The thief sheds light on the potential wealth within you that can never be stolen. Sheds light on the potential wealth within you that can never be stolen. As we're talking about thieves and, and energy harvesters and all this other stuff. And other types of harvesting too. Um, awakens the, the child wounded. Awakens compassion and desire to serve other wounded children. Opens the learning path for forgiveness or of forgiveness. Um, child divine innocence purity and redemption suggests a special connection with the divine and father talent for creating and supporting life positive guiding light within a tribal unit how beautiful my loveys how beautiful for some of you um you do have ancestor uh energies that really protect you they really go to bat for you and it's not to say to harm anybody but karma is due when karma is due justice is due when justice is due uh just doing what's right for you it's important my lovies we have a destroyer releasing what is potentially destructive and preparing for new life because that's exactly what you're doing all right my lovies that was beautiful i have to say i have to say um stay well my lovies stay well i'm um, being cautious of the energies that are around you my lovies because these energies do impact you and for some some energies really agitate uh the energy around you or inside of you so being cautious that that does not necessarily belong to you you can acknowledge it um but um it's okay to let the divine do what the, the divine does you don't have to go out of your way to to uh talk to anybody or have any types of discussions divine justice is always at play for us my lovies uh it's up to us to remember it or not, but um, it's okay. Stay well, my lovies. Your sister friend loves you and adores you. Loves you and adores you. Your spirit friends love you and adore you. Love you and adore you. Your sister friend loves you and adores you. Loves you and adores you. Your spirit friends and your sister friend and your spirit friends and your sister friend. And love always and love always and love always and forever. Peace.